Hey everyone, I'm going to show you different ways to tie a sarong skirt, brought to you by Yumi and Cora. First is the quick knot, we'll do the long skirt. So you'll grab the top corners of your sarong and slide your hands down from the corners to your waist. This will form two ties and you'll tie those into a single knot. Next is the quick knot, but the mid-length skirt. So you'll fold the sarong in half or to whatever length you like. And do the same as before. So slide your hands from the corner to your waist on both sides to form two ties and then tie those into a single knot. Next is the tight tuck, the long skirt. So tightly wrap one side against your hips and then wrap the other side around and you'll tuck the top corner into the waistband. Next is the tight tuck, but the mid-length skirt. So again, you'll fold the sarong in half or to whatever length you like and wrap one side across your body and bring the other side around and tuck in the top corner into your waistband. Now this is the tight tuck, the short skirt. So you'll fold the sarong in half two times and you can kind of adjust the length to how short you want the skirt to be. So wrap one side across your body, bring the other side around and tuck in the top corner of the sarong into your waistband. Next is the tight knot, the long skirt. So like before, you'll wrap one side of the sarong across your body, but leave the corner hanging out. This will be used as a tie. Bring the other side around and you'll tie the two corners together into a single or a double knot. And you can tuck the ties into your waistband if you like. Next is the tight knot, the mid-length skirt. So fold the sarong in half or to your desired length. And like before, you'll wrap one side but leave the corner hanging out. And wrap the other side around. And then tie the two corners into a single or a double knot. The last one is the tight knot but the short skirt, so you'll fold the sarong in half two times or to however short you like it. And then wrap one side leaving the corner hanging out and bring around the other side. And you can try to tie the two corners into a single or a double knot. This is a little bit harder if you have bigger hips. It might be a little bit hard to tie it. Next is the grab and knot, the long skirt. So instead of grabbing the corners and tying them together, you'll grab the fabric near your waist and make two ties with it. And then you'll tie those into a double knot. Next is the grab and knot, the mid-length skirt. So you will fold the sarong in half or to however long you like. 
And again, you'll make two ties with the fabric near your waist. You'll kind of bunch the fabric and then tie those together into a double knot. Next is the quick roll. You'll wrap one side tight against your body, bring the other side around, and instead of tying, you'll just roll the waistband down. And it becomes secure, it won't come undone. It's really quick, quick to do. And the last style is the fold and knot, the long skirt. So you'll fold your sarong in half crosswise. Bring it behind your body and then you'll just tie a double knot with the top two corners. And you'll see the tassels this time are hanging down at the bottom of your sarong. And here's the fold and knot, the short skirt. So you'll fold your sarong crosswise two times. You can make it whatever length you want to be a short skirt. Bring it around your body and just tie the top two corners into a double knot. So as you can see, there's lots of ways to make a sarong skirt. You can dress it up, dress it down. If you like our sarongs, you can check us out at yumiancora.com or at yumiancora on Instagram. Click to learn how to tie a sarong kimono or a sarong dress. Thanks for watching.